Good morning everybody, Jen from Heavenly Sensations. Um, just a quick little video. Um, I went out with my coupon book yesterday and um, I was actually pretty impressed with what I pulled off. I don't have the stuff with me today so in the next couple days I'll try and take a video of the stuff that I did buy. But I basically scored about $98 worth of stuff for under $10. Um, Shoppers Drug Mart had a special for $5 off of Motrin. We go through a lot of pain relief stuff in the house, um, especially with me with my fibro. I don't like to take anything too heavy unless I need it. I just use over-the-counter stuff. Um, so they had $5 off. So Normally the bottles were $5.99, so you got them for $0.99. Cent. The liquid gels were normally $6.99, so you got them for $1.99. You were only allowed two per person, so I had my son go ahead and buy two as well. But, um, I scored, I, I'm going to have to explain this a little bit. Um, in the past I have tried different things for quitting smoking. But um, I find anything that has really high milligrams makes me dizzy or breaks me out. I can't use the lozenges in my mouth. They annoy me. Um, they burn. So yesterday I had found some $5 off coupons for um, the Nicorette patches. And my shopper's drum art has them on clearance for $3.99. So I scored those for free. Now the only thing is shoppers not very clear on their own coupon policies. I guess it's still in the works. Um, I had been under the impression that shoppers would give you your overages, but basically what they did was took my five dollar coupon and uh, marked it at three ninety nine. So I still paid the tax for them, but I mean that that's nothing. Um, I scored um, some a few other things, but I don't want to mention on the video because. Um, they are guests, and that person could possibly be watching this video, so I'm not going to talk about them right now until after they've received their guest. Um, but I do plan on going back out. I might pick up the rest of the patches because um, enough to take the edge off. Like yesterday, I didn't even have my first cigarette until 9 o'clock at night. Um, I guess it all depends on the day. Some days I'll only smoke a cigarette and other days I'll smoke five, sometimes more. But I'm finding more and more that I just don't want them. Um, but I do think that I'll need something to help me along. So I'm going to try the patch and see how it goes. If not, I mean I can always give them away to a friend that may want to try them. The point is I scored them for free. I did not think that I'd be able to pull you know the free thing off in Canada but I did do it um, I have a few other things that I'm trying to map out I started my um, coupon book last night I actually sat there clipping coupons and somewhat organizing them I don't have a whole lot to start right now so I mean there wasn't a whole lot to organize but I do have you know a plan in my head um, so we're going to see how that goes in the next little while. I just really wish that I could get some of the uh, inserts that everybody else seems to be getting, like the red plum. And I think there's another one, but like I said, we don't get them a whole lot around here. So I mainly rely on what I can find online or have mailed to me. So if you know of any other good sites for Canada, uh, feel free to let me know. I do know of the main ones. Um, and I'm hoping to get more in the mail today because I did send away for a lot but I did notice that one of the main uh, sites um, what is it called? PG Brand Saver I believe it's called is down and has been down for at least a week so that's kind of um, getting in the way of my real start to my couponing but hopefully that'll be up soon um, other than that not a whole lot to talk about um, other than I was out searching for a few items, which of course I can't find around here as usual. Um, I went out looking for a really good stippling brush. I couldn't even find a stippling brush at all. So 
Um, I guess the next thing is maybe check with Chopper's Drug Mart because that was the one place I didn't look at the brushes. The only thing I don't like to buy from there because they are quite costly. Um, they're probably just as expensive as some of the mask brushes. Our Canadian brand is called Quo. Um, it's really good quality, don't get me wrong, but um, I'm not the type of person to pay that kind of money, especially for a makeup brush. Um, I went out and priced um, makeup mirrors because I'm trying to figure out a nice little setup in my room. Um, other than that, yeah, I don't really have a whole lot to say. I just wanted to uh, do the quick blurb about the couponing because I was super excited that I actually managed to get something for free. Um, so I'll keep you updated and hopefully within the next day or two I'll do a quick little college video maybe. Not that it's going to be huge, but showing what I managed to get and what I paid for it. Okay everybody, have yourselves a great day.